In this video, I'm going to show you a neat trick that you can use in Google Apps for Education Mail or in Gmail in general. It's going to save you a lot of time and stress when you have deleted something that you think you actually need to find. So our typical tendency when we are in an email is we read through it, we look at it, yep, I've got that information, and then we come up and we delete it. And this is, note that this is test 19. If I delete that email, it is now gone from my inbox, but then I go, oh, I needed something in that email. Um, some of you may know that technically it is still available if you scroll all the way down here and you go hunting through your trash. But a much easier way to do this is once you're done with your email, once you've scanned it, rather than using delete, come over and use this down arrow. This is the archive key. Archive it. It takes it out of the inbox, but it is not trashed. It's still in the system. It's just not showing in your inbox. And this way, you can actually use the search bar here, and you can search for it. And you can see that it's right there, test 18. That was the one that I had just looked for. Um, so I can, you know, from the inbox again, I can, I can put a whole bunch of these into the archive. And then if I come up here and search for them, they will all show up here. Notice what is not showing up though is test 19. That was the very first one that I deleted. Emails that are in the garbage, in the, uh, the deleted file, are not searchable. So this is a much easier way to go about this. I've gotten into the habit, I don't delete anything anymore. I just archive everything, regardless of whether it's trash and I know that, or it's not. That way I never have to think, gosh, did I put that in the garbage? Did I delete it or did I just archive it? And so all of my email is searchable. Google gives you a huge amount of email space. So just use it up, um, use the, the archive button, and that way it's always available to you if you need it at a later date.